one day the job opened and I applied for it. Teresa Bowles says becoming a police officer wasn't necessarily a lifelong dream of hers, but a chance for change. I was looking for a career that would be a little more challenging and a little more diverse and interesting as well as being able to want to, you know, help people. And she found that challenge she was looking for. A 22-year LPD veteran, Bull spent the first 10 years of her career working the midnight shift. It definitely was an eye-opener. She since worked daytime and evening shifts in the vice department and is currently assigned to administration. Bull says the midnight shift was a blessing in disguise. That probably was one of the best things about working down here was actually going in and working that, that very fast-paced and sometimes violent shift um, because you, you learn and you learn quickly and you learn to adapt. Bulls is one of many involved in a trend that's taking shape around Texas. Just this week, Austin Police Department added 22 female officers to their force and are looking to hire more. While she enjoys her job, Bulls says it's a different experience for a woman. I have had both experiences. One where uh, I wasn't perceived as much of a threat as a male officer, uh, which you're able to work around and some people may not take you seriously. I've actually gone out there where um, someone has been insulted that I've been a female officer out there. I've been in situations and dealing with people where they refuse to talk to me because I was a female. There are also some advantages. We can actually relate more in, in certain aspects of, of female victims or even, even children. Uh, it not necessarily that the men cannot, but that these victims will see us in more of a, in more of a light as our role um, as a woman. We may be needing to search somebody and, and we can actually diffuse an awkward situation uh, when there are just men involved. Bull says she encourages any woman who's interested in becoming an officer to pursue a career. And, and don't think that they, they can't because they're just a girl and says she believes having men and women on the force makes for a well-rounded team on the streets. Bailey Joe Miller, Fox 34, News at 9.